The human egg is one of the biggest cells in our body and plays a key role in reproduction. It holds 23 chromosomes, which is half of the DNA needed to make a baby. Egg development starts before birth when early cells turn into immature eggs. These eggs stay paused in early development until puberty. Every month, hormones signal several egg follicles to start growing. But usually just one egg fully matures and gets ready to be released during ovulation. The mature egg is surrounded by a protective outer layer called the zona pellucida. Inside the egg, the fluid contains important structures and RNA from the mother. Depending on its stage, the egg may also have one or two small polar bodies. The zona pellucida is a sugar protein layer that helps sperm stick to the egg using special receptors called ZP3. It also prevents more than one sperm from entering after fertilization. The egg's mitochondria give energy to support the first stages of embryo growth. Only the mother's mitochondria pass their DNA to the baby. The egg pauses in the second phase of cell division until a sperm arrives. When a sperm enters, the egg finishes dividing and releases a second small polar body. During ovulation, the mature egg comes out of the ovary follicle and is caught by tiny finger-like fimbriae and moved into the fallopian tube toward the uterus. As women get older, egg quality drops, which raises the chance of chromosome problems like having extra or missing ones. A woman's ability to get pregnant naturally goes down a lot after age 35. The human egg is a very special cell with crucial genetic material that helps start the baby's development and provides half of its DNA. Knowing how the egg works is important for understanding reproduction.